Hi guys, I was coming with you a special. This is a bonus ad, so I'm gonna give you my top ad moves that I love um, and love to do. But just remember, abs are made in the kitchen. It's 80% nutrition, 20% exercise. So if you wanna move some of that, that um, excess, it's a lot of fluid actually that we can carry in our abdominal area. So if you wanna move some of that stubborn fat, some of that um, water retention, it actually starts in the kitchen. So make sure you jump on to a 10 day kickstart because it's going to help you move that off that area. But come down with me, we're going to do some moves, but first let's do a warm up. So we're coming in on all fours, we're pushing through, we're lifting up and we're stretching and lengthening. So we're just coming through and warming up those abdominals before we get into them. So be short and sweet. You can go back through and do it a few times if you like. Now some of the moves will be challenging, so it's just to give them a go. Um, and it's meant to be able to just Something to work towards. So there's a few more here. It's always important to wake the body up. And let's just come down and give a few pushes up, a nice stretch of the abdominals. Let's just do five of these and three more. Two. And oh, good work. The planks, everyone does planks, I know. But it's such a great way to tone the body. So with planks, I'm pushing through all my fingers. I'm lifting, so I'm not just hanging here, I'm lifting through that. My glutes are engaged. My legs are engaged. So one I love to do is you're bringing that knee to the side. So you're getting those obliques. We're working here. Okay. Let's go from there. So I love this move. I'm coming down and holding that plank and I'm using my abs and my glutes to pull me back up. And then come down. And come back into our plank. Now from here, I'm just going to put that knee across and touch. And you can do this fast if you like. Just get a bit of cardio in. So let's go. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And here for five, four, three, two, one. Let's come down to those knees, stretch it back. Inhale and exhale. And let's come up. Now we're going to go into our side planks. So if you need to, you can keep that knee bent down. We can come with me. And we're just lifting and sticking those feet. We can bring my feet slightly forward. So I'm here and I'm not hanging. I'm still actively pushing through here. Now these are great ones, but I don't know if a lot of people don't like them. Hip dips. I'm going up and down. It's really working out oblique. Up and down. I don't know about you, but if we have babies, <laughs> and I've had four of them, and breastfeed a lot of them, our breastfeeding stalls are right here. <laughs> so right now, I'm lifting and toning where those breastfeeding stalls were. Let's go for another five, four, three. I'm actually getting sweaty doing this. Two. Arms, hold up. You can lift that arm. You can lift that leg if you want. And let's hold for five, four, three, two, one. Let's bring that down. And let's rock and roll this up. I'll turn around for you so you can see me. You have to watch my backside. So we're here. So remember, if you need to, you can just come here with the hip lifts. Or you can join me. And we're here. And let's go. Lifting those hips to the ceiling. So I'm lifting up. In. And so we active through this arm. And I'm thinking about my hips going towards that ceiling. And if I'm not touching the ground, I'm just kind of hovering above and lifting back up. Let's go for five, four, three, two, and one. Let's hold. If you want to challenge yourself, lift your leg up. And let's go for five, four, three, two, one, and down. And up. So we're going to come here. The legs bend. I'm going to twist our body around. Oh, it feels like a nice stretch. I'm not going to stay for long. And we're going to crunch up. 
This is just giving abs another angle. So I'm lifting and crunching up. Lifting and crunching. I'm not pulling on my head, I'm focusing on those abdominals. Drawing in. So inhale and exhale. Let's go from the five, four, three, two, and the last one's hold it there for five, four, three, two, one. It's good to put a bit of tension on those muscles. Let's look around the other side. Let's hold that stretch there for a second. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Let's lift up. Lifting and squeezing. Lifting and squeezing. Check out your abs. Are they working? Can you feel them? Let's go. You lift even higher. Let's go for another five. Four. Three. Two. And one. And five. Four. Three. Two. One. And bring it down. Let's come onto our backs. We move to the center of my foot. Yeah. Okay. I've got a bun issue here. Okay, let's lift those legs up. Everyone loves a little bit of Pilates. So let's just warm those abs up, abs up first. As I'm strengthening and lengthening my leg out, I'm making sure that the lower back isn't moving. My rib cage is drawn in. And I'm using my breath to engage those abs. My tailbone is slightly tilted. But there's like a little blueberry under your back. You don't want to squish that berry, but you want to feel that berry. So I'm just stretching my legs out there. Then when you're ready, you can pop the hands behind the head and you can lift up and stretch and lengthen and stretch and lengthen. And then when you're ready, you can come and bring the hands up. And I'm lifting and I'm engaging and I'm lengthening those legs. Like I'm drawing a line up and down the wall. And then bring those legs in, hold there. Now we're going to go side to side. Let's go. I'm trying to reach to the corner mat. If it's too much on your back and your abs, you can pop the legs down and tap and tap. We're going to lift up and just go for there. Let's do another 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Oh, let's bring those knees in. Let's just give the abs a stretch the opposite direction. Kind of lifting them up. Pushing through those glutes. Pushing up through the shoulders. And stretching out those abdominals. Inhale. And exhale. Let's roll down that spine. Let's take a couple of roll ups. Let's go one. Two. If you want to try and challenge this up. Last one, we're going to come up and we're going to hold. And then if you like to straighten your legs and hold. Challenging those lower abs. And, and we're going to come just to a side line. So I'm going to hop down knee. One hand across up here. Reaching here. And I'm just going to lift that leg. Just working the side of my body here. Just a little bit of leg in. So active through the abdominals. Let's just go from the five. Three, two, one. And we're going to come up. Hands to the other side. And we're going to lift. And lift. And lift. And lift. Good. The dogs are quickly break. And then we're just going to get them to them again. It'll be our last round of things. Nice and lifting through there. Five. Three, two, four, one. Now I'm just going to plant that leg down, lift my hands up, and I'm going to dip side and come up. There's a little bit of movement. I'm going down to where I can go and come back up. My arms are by my ears. I'm moving my body out like I'm in between two walls. And I'm going down and lifting up. Down. Yeah. I'm going to go again, but this time we have to look this way and that way. So you 
find the two a little different. Bring your hands up, levering out. So you might be able to come a little lower. And you just going to control that left on each side. And down and left. Next side. Stretch at that side. Stretch that side of the body. Oh, that feels good. Nice big one. Take a moment to stretch. Give you more time to make muscles in there nice and loose. So we're reaching with that hand and reaching with that knee. And it comes to the other side. So this leg comes out and anchors. So we're nice anchor there. Hands are straight up. My pelvis is tucked under. And I'm coming and I'm tilting. And lifting up. And I'm using those abdominals to lower and lift. Just like a big lever. Down and up. Down and up. And I'm trying to breathe. <laughs> Don't forget to breathe. You kind of reset yourself every time you come up and then down. Let's just go for another five here. About five. Stretch it out and you're all done. So let's just go for five, four, three, two, one. And let's just come down and stretch it out there. Enjoy that stretch, enjoy that time. Don't forget to hydrate after, drink plenty of water. That's especially effective for the, for the belly. Make sure you pull into your water in. And plenty of greens, lots of greens. Just helps move all that sludge out of our kidney and livers, just give lots of water and good stuff into us. So let's just come down. We're just going to lower onto our backs. And we're going to bring those hands forward so with one leg and arm at the time, like we're swimming. We're just slowly swimming through the water, strengthening up our backs. You can relax your head if you like, just put your forehead on the mat. Up and down. This time when you come up, just hold and lift a little higher. And lift a little higher. And just hold that for five, four, three, two, one, and come down. Let's do the other side. And just hold and lift a little higher and higher. And hold for five, four, three, two, one, and drop down. If you lift both arms and move off the neck, you lift your head. And look just forward to yourself. And breathe. And hop. For five, four, three, two, one. And drop down. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. On your next breath in. On your exhale, let's lift again. Let's inhale. And exhale. And then lift it. And we're going to bring our arms out. And in. Out. And in. So like we're making little snow angels. And I'm just looking in front, I'm looking right ahead of me right there. <laughs> and let's just go for five, four. And if this is too much in your lower back, just drop those legs down. Three, two, four. And let's bring that down. Good work, guys. Just take a wee stretch. There's our arms here. And we're just pushing up. Gently stretching through the abdominals. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you feel those abs. And let's just come back down. Inhale and you exhale. Come from the left full upward dog. Lift your stars off the ground. And just looking up the wall. And you tilt to the side. Just get a bit more stretch. 
meal size. Just come back onto our all fours and stretch out back the other direction. Let's inhale. Awesome guys, you're welcome to stretch a little longer, but I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you again.